up YouTube? We're back to the video. In this video, we're going over how to make coins with the new Ultimate Alumni packs coming out today. All we know about the packs is so far, all I know is we have LCD Kyle Pitts, which best tight end in the game, might be one of the best receivers in the game. He's a very versatile player because he's he's a tall tight end that's fast and can do everything. But what I think is gonna be really good tomorrow. Flipping right now is tough, but you're gonna you're gonna have to you're gonna have to somehow push through. I'm gonna assume A two A threes will probably be better to start doing now. And like you're start, gonna start having to go up in the overall ranks. Right now A twos go for eight twenty two K for Ultra Alumni and A threes go for like 45, 47, but expect these cards to go down a little bit. To figure out on your, your unfiltered price for your A3s, I would be going over here to your ultimate alumni set right here. Flick right stick up. Shows you right here. 3, 2, 1, bang. You're over 46k. You're, if it, you see that, times your thing by 0.9. Subtract whatever much profit you want to get. So, like, example, if you're 40, 46k right now, I'd buy them for like 40. No, I'll buy them for like 37. Make a few thousand. I'll take it. Take a few thousand profit. And do that over and over again. Check A2s. A2s currently going for 21,000. I'm going to want to get for like around 16, 17K. Profit a little bit. Your 80 to 80, your 80 to 81, you can still do the ultra alumni. They might have, they might keep up their price a little bit. They're currently around 14K, so I'd want to get, get them for around 10. But you guys have to check your prices, you know. Price will change. 80 overalls currently. Time recording, they're going for 16k. I would probably want to get for a 12. They currently are expensive because of that set uh, for XP. Um, which is interesting. I'm expecting the reel to be going up to around 11, 1200, 11, 11 or 1200 training per pack. I will be testing the pack out. Um, these guys hit the like goal, but if you get like 20 likes on this video, I'll do a sniping challenge. See much coins I make in like an hour or two. Um, but let's go over some filters we can do. Obviously, you can go A2, A3, Ultimate Alumni. Which, how you do that, you go A2, A3, Ultimate Alumni program. Let it load. You go position by position. Um, like receiver. Let me look who's here. We have tight end, we have lineman. So let's go like wide receiver real quick. Um, I mean, that's not an awful buy, but I'm not going to buy it. Um, like you just put a newest, look for what your prices are, for what you want, and just go position by position, and try to get a snap. Whenever it pops up. You're not guaranteed to obviously get snipes right away, but hopefully after a little bit, you should get, you should start seeing some snipes, hopefully. And then you can buy them, make some profit, easy coins, right? If you don't want to do 81, you can do also do 8 to 81s. Not awful either. These got to be more questionable with them. You got to make sure you check on their prices because their price might be dropping a lot. Their price might go up. We don't know. It depends on what they have for, if they have like an XP challenge for doing sets again for the set for them. Um. But 85s are actually not that bad to do. As dumb as it sounds. Um, 85s actually like, oh, let's like, these 85s are gonna be flooded, obviously. Mike Evans will be flooded on the market like crazy. He's 130 right now. I see him probably going down to 90, 80. Like you, he, people are gonna put them up for like 50k. Buy him for 50k, so I'm back for profit. It's gonna be easy profit. It might be a little competitive because people will be doing it. Same thing as Air Kendricks. Air Kendricks will be thrown up for cheap because people will be opening lottery rolls for LTDs and people will be throwing these cards up like like hotcakes on the market. Same thing you're gonna notice. Same thing about you're gonna have uh, same thing about your A6 overalls. You're gonna be seeing a lot of them pop up. Because there's not many, there's not many champions in the reroll. If you, I don't know if you guys saw in case you missed the rerolls, but orange animation were flying out of those for people. Like crazy. So you're gonna see like Saquon's, 
Lamar is probably going to drop. I'm expecting Josh Allen tomorrow. I'm expecting the cards tomorrow. It's, I, I think it's going to be Josh Allen, the Kyle Pitts. The defense, I think it's going to be Isaiah Simmons and um, Chris Jones. Or, like, or the, like, the fourth Buckner. Like, well, well, the, like well, I'll be, I think LT is going to get a deep tackle. And the champion's going to be Isaiah Simmons. Don't know why, just trust. If the offer of the champion isn't Josh Allen, it'll be, I think it'll be Devon Smith, but Devon Smith doesn't make sense right now. I think next week makes sense. Wait, Devon Smith already got a, wait. Sorry, Devon Smith doesn't make any sense. He already got a card. I don't know what I'm thinking. I think it's Josh Allen for sure. I think Josh Allen's coming out. Um, So quarterback marker will go down, probably, most likely. But Michael, we see, we see Michael probably drop to 160, probably. We'll see Miles Garrett drop all the way under 100, probably easily, easily under 100k, easily. Lamar's probably gonna be under 300, 250 probably. I think Lamar will be Saquon's gonna be probably 200 or less. On Saquon's probably gonna be like 150. Market's gonna crash. Market's gonna crash on these cards, and the new cards will be prob four or 500k. I would say because there isn't many champions. But what I could see happening: 88 overall legendary cards. These cards, I could see them going up, and I could see them going down at the same time. Um, because people are going to be wanting to buy training for rerolls, but people are going to also be pulling this card, this card like wildfire. So sniping these cards won't be a bad idea. When you're on the filter, go on your newest, um, you, I mean, you might as well go offense, defense. But, just sit here, go on newest, you can, if a Jew can pop up for 400k, buy it. Will John pop up for 400k, buy it. If he's pop up for 200k, buy it. Make your easy profit, make your easy coins. It, it's easy profits. All you're looking for, honestly. If you want to use such a legendary instead, so you see Luther Burden if you want to. Snipe those, snipe those cards, just make your coins. That's all you're going for. Make coins, make coins, make coins. Do not open packs. Unless there is a glitch, which most likely there will not be a glitch. If there's a glitch, then I'm just hoping you know somehow. I don't know. I I really don't know. I don't really don't know. But my top things I'll be doing, uh, probably safe bet would be probably going for alumni cards. Then you could go, then um like a two a two a three alumni eighty five only might be fun though to go with. Um, if you don't want to do those stuff, you can still go look at your playbooks, type your playbooks, like like check every once in a while, look at your playbook, like go to each team, um, go to like Auburn, Arizona, Alabama. Bama, sort of. Um, Georgia. We have Kansas. We have Rutgers. Oregon. Teams like those teams. Go look at the playbooks, you know. Look at the, the profit for the snipe up. Which right here is not. Let's go look at it quickly. Let's go look at Auburn real quick. Is there a snipe for Auburn? The answer is no. Pretty easy, pretty easy profit if, you, if there is one chilling up there for you. And then another one, strat cards, you can always just check your strat cards real quick. Just Either way you do this, just go here, click newest. It's either like a D backup for like 15k or less. Other ones are for quick sell. Like a 9k quick sell. Just buy it, sell back, you know, make some easy free coins. But, cheers like and subscribe. I'll see you next time.